Okay, here we are. We are back. Need to check something really quick. All right, something weird's going on here. Give me a minute. What the heck? Well, kind of just... Uh, All right. All right, I think I got to take care of now. So we're good. What a pain in the butt. Okay, here we're going to continue with a little bit more of uh, cyberpunk shenanigans in Night City. Hey everyone, feels great to have you back. So then, did you all hear about that Arasaka aircraft carrier docked in Night City called Kujira or the Whale? Apparently, the corp figured it wasn't safe in Japanese waters. Afraid some All right, let's see if we can adjust. Harpoon it for scientific research. <sighs> Settings. I want to get at least 60 frames per second. So let's go to video or graphics. Okay, let's see if that helps. There we go, that's better. something when I jagged into that corpo's biomine. No, no real virus. I check out my house. Need to see Vic. Let him tell me what's got my head reeling, my stomach churning. Okay, let me take you. I brought you a ride. Throw on some threads, meet me downstairs. Cruise around in here, so I want to check stuff out. Essentially, all forms of life have been wiped clean from the mega city. Millions of people, animals, and got over here. Oh, they to this day who stray too close to the southern edge of the Korean peninsula and the waters surrounding it. Though not all in the city lie still, automated systems powered by local tidal energy continue to operate unsupervised. Netwatch has warned that without proper maintenance, any Busan-based AI could, in time, pose a considerable threat. Arasaka has washed their hands of the issue, placing full blame for the ecological and subsequent technical crisis with Militech, who dropped the bombs. NUSA President Rosalind Myers has declined to comment on the matter. Meanwhile, in Europe, the Pedanian government is once again... Oh, we're going to go with that.
stolen works eventually find their way to collectors in private orbital stations, making reclamation a difficult process. Further west, Switzerland has officially become the first nation committed to a fully automated military by 2080. Okay, I got everything I need. Anytime I make changes, I save it, so... Okay, there we go. Had to mess with my, uh, moving my chat window around, etc. All right, now we're going to resume. What else do I need to look at around here? Done with this. So, what? You embarrassed? Hey, V. Regina Jones here. If you're looking for work in Watson, give me a call. How'd you find me? How'd you even know my name? I know where to gather my intel. Could even call me a collector. Later, V. Shit. All right. It used to be an elevator. Walking, just passing through, guys. Oh, Newt. Got another dry, sun-filled week coming your way, Night City. But soak in that sun while you can. There's a cold front moving in. Prepare for cooler conditions as we head into the weekend. All right, now we gotta find Jackie. Where are you, Jackie? Around over there? Are you kidding me? Nine 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 nine. Trauma team. Don't forget, you're worth it. Take a pulsar to a job like this? Are you stupid? Where'd you think these prices come from? Just be happy it's only your hand. Yeah. Got another dry, sun-filled week coming your way, Night City. But soak in that sun while you can. There's a cold front moving in. Prepare for cooler conditions as we head into the weekend. How the hell did I get over there? Guess I got to run around like a crazy man. Got another dry, sun-filled week coming your way, Night City. But soak in that sun while you can. There's a cold front moving in. Prepare for okay. conditions. Or we've been over here. Let's go down.
get around there over this way. Shit, come on! Oh, no, no, no. know what the worst thing is about this place? Love the dialogue. Hey, yo, V. How about a round or two? What do you say? Not today. How you like my new puppy? Hey, thank you, that. However, in an abundance of caution, the NCPD has raised the threat level to two, advising travelers to avoid side roads. We'll continue to keep you informed as the situation develops. Hello, it's time for your local news. The Aratama Matsuri Festival is nearly upon us. To mark the event, the streets of Night City will come alive with exquisite multi-story dashi floats. The festival program will also include musical performances by Biwa virtuosos and theatrical performances in the No tradition. The sponsor for the festival is the Arasaka Corporation. And, in an exciting development, even Hanako Arasaka has announced her participation in the Dashi Parade. From all of us at WNS News, we wish you... Hey, Jackie. What's up, bro? Mm. Man of the hour. <laughs> Sheesh. Took you long enough. Worked up an appetite just waiting. Sit down. Let me finish this. Then we can drop in on Senor Vector. Mentioned something about a surprise yesterday. Am I remembering right or just had a brain fart? Probably both, because you usually forget shit. But it just so happens, I think I might have bagged us a sweet ass J-O-B. Go on. I mean, maybe it's not as big as that, but just that he's fronted by a little known someone named Dexter Deshaun. Only the top fixer in night fucking city. Fat ass black Jesus of the afterlife. 300 pounds of partly gold plated coup. <laughs> So what's the gig? We meant to come out in one piece? Our Lord and Savior wants to tell you everything himself, face to face. Oh, no pressure, but uh, this whole deal, he's riding on you now, I see. I'm glad to. All right, I gotta try one more setting. Set it down to medium. That's better. All right, dude. All right. Let's hear what old Dex has to say. Set it up. Dex is a real deal when it comes to fixers. Don't get me wrong. Don't got nothing against the Padre or Wakako, but Dex is his own. You know what I'm saying? Not really. Not really. No. It's always the same story. You land on fresh turf, local fixer waves his dick around, but he's smiling, saying you'll be up to your neck in gigs and eddies. Still, all you are is another name in their little black book. Nifty tool for getting them a fat slice of whatever half-baked shit pie their client put on the table. <laughs> sure, you crack jokes over drinks, but in the end, it's biz. Gracias, Dios. Estoy lleno. Brought your wheels. Gave them to my guy yesterday to smooth over the dents after our uh, dust up with the scabs. Thanks, Jack. Much appreciated. Okay, what are we doing now? Top-notch work Miguel did. Rides like it looks. Factory new. We'll see about that. So we rolling or what? 
Yeah, let's go. Let's feel this factory new ride. First stop, Ripper Dock, and Holmes. Easy on the gas, huh? I just ate. I was supposed to stop by Vix anyhow. I got a date. Me and Miss D. You don't say. She's so I sweet. I can't drive for shit. God, really I hate driving. Me, you know? Oops, sorry. 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 I said I can't drive for shit. Yeah, I ain't get no points for this, I can tell you that. Yeah, this is it. Come on, V. Find me once Vic's done dusting your circuits. We'll hash out what Dex has cooked up for us. V, get it together. I'm coming, I'm coming. Give me a break. See you now. I'll sit tight over here. Me and Misty got a little kitchen up to do. Nah, Dr. Becker. You look pleased. Cause I am. Always. Makes for easier living. Vicky, surprise every old ripper. It's good to see you. Good to see you too, V. It's been a while. So what do I owe the pleasure today? Last gig. Had to jack into a client's neuro socket. I think I might have gotten spiked. Experiencing migraines, nausea, hypersensitivity to bright lights. Old kit and caboodle. All right, kit. We'll sort you out in a flash. Besides that, how are things? Need some new kit, but tools, not toys, Vic. Time I bumped up my sights and got a grip. <laughs> really? Now? Finally? Vic, shit's getting real. Got a job for Dex to Sean, hitting the major leagues. Need tech that can perform. The Dexter Deshaun? <laughs> well, that is something. But let me guess. Hasn't paid you yet. Quit crying, Vic. I'll bring you the Eddies later, with interest. You know I will. Hmm. Last time, you hear? Chair, please. Sit down and relax. Roshi Optics. Best I've got, and should be about right under the circumstances. Now jack in. You peruse and choose while I scan. Let's see what's going on inside. Okay, Cyberox so implants are mechanical replacements for the organic parts of your body. They can give you superhuman-like abilities, which can improve your combat capability and help you survive hazardous conditions. Although a common practice in 2077, the installation of cyberware is still invasive and sometimes dangerous medical procedure. Only specialists known as Ripper Docs 
or trusted to install Cedra well safely. Okay, got it. Okay. Oh boy, tough. I don't have enough money. Okay, cool. Wow, 15K, 25K. Okay, can't afford that. I've only got five. Gee, Louise. Well, that's free, I'll take that. Arms. Can't afford any of that stuff. Nope, can't afford that. Anything else I can buy? I gotta make me some ducats. All right, well, that's about all I can afford. All right, nothing I want to do there. Okay. Mark one, like I said.
Decent enough scanner. Displays data on your cornea. Cherry on the top's a built-in external lens disruptor. In layman's terms, any surveillance cam will capture your face as a blur. And just remember, your body will still show up as crystal clear. Hmm. This should do the trick. Talks to Kuroshi Tech, too. I'm ready. Carve away. Excellent. Let's do this. All right, that here major we go. league arm of yours right here. Just like that. Thanks. Now, a bit of anesthetic and I can start cutting. Feel anything? <laughs> play by play, though. Really, Doc? Makes it sound like a dentist. Always going on and on. Don't be mean now. Remember, I'm old. I got a shaky Gannick hand. Could slip. <laughs> Lights out for a minute, all right? Okay, let's test this. See the magic in action. Linking you in. You might feel a little discomfort at first. Blurred vision, low contrast, glitches. Wow. Well, how's it look? Feel all right to you? Better than ever. Oh, this is fantastic, Vic. <laughs> oh, beautiful. Okay, scanning people with your obstacle cyberware can provide you with a lot of useful information, such as how strong an enemy might be, who is in their crew, or what type of weapon they use. As a skilled net runner, you'll see a list of quick hacks which you can use against your enemies. Okay, got it. Time for the scanner. It might take you a few seconds to adjust, but first time's rarely the charm, <laughs> with anything, really. Scanner should eventually sync with your thought processes and read your intentions. I also inject an NCPD file search. Run into any ne'er-do-wells? <laughs> you know exactly what they ne'er did well. <laughs> That's pretty funny. <laughs> okay, database, database of individuals with bounties assigned to them is now available to use. You can identify these wanted persons with your scanner. Since all... <coughs> Are wanted dead or alive, the methods you use to claim your reward is entirely up to you. Oh, good. <laughs> it ought to work like a charm. Now draw your weapon. You should see your ammo count in a brand new sight. Thanks, Vic. Oh, I'll ask him about the virus. How about the neurovirus from the last job? Can you check it? Done and gone while we were putting in your implant. And a full sweep on your soft and circuits. Zap the critter. You're certified bug free. Thanks, Vic. Shit, Vic, they're not bad. I don't know what to say. Say you'll take this and remember the dosage. Two whiffs now, and another two in an hour. Thanks again, Vic. You're the best. I owe you. Yeah, you do. Go on, kid. Show them what you're made of. And once you hit the big leagues, don't forget where you came from. That's pretty cool. Guard up, you idiot. Go 
on, punch him. Ah. Jab with your left. Left, goddammit. Guard up, you idiot. Chakra looks a little out of whack, babe. Not old. I can release it for you, but you'd have to watch out for negative energy fields and avoid mean reds. Anything red. V. He's waiting in his ride for you. Ain't but a hop to where he's parked next to Gramsci Burgers. Okay, do my best to talk us up. Okay, Dex is over here. But you are not hey, listen. I've got this delicate matter. That's why I called you. The number of cyber psycho attacks in the city is on the rise. Now, that's probably not news to you, but this issue matters to me for a few reasons. There are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated. Right. And I know exactly how that sounds. But I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Max Tag hits the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick him up. I hope that's all clear. Okay, there are various ways to incapacitate enemies without killing them. One, non-lethal takedowns. Non-lethal quick hacks. Non-lethal weapons, EMT grenades, and some combat gadgets. Weapon mods that change uh, to non-lethal. If given a weapon, combat gadget, a quick hack deals non-lethal damage. It will be mentioned in the description. Got it. But you are not the masters of your memory. Only to you. Wow, look at all this stuff. I got lots of jobs to do. Look at all that. Holy wow. Okay, close. But you are not the master of your memory. <laughs> For your eyes so. do not belong to you, or rather, not only. You want trouble? Not really. We got everybody. All right, I'm gonna go meet with this Dex guy. Pleasure. Dexter Deshaun in the flesh. Ample indeed. <laughs> Let's roll. <laughs> Mind if I ask you something right off the bank? Would you rather live in pieces, Mr. Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory, smelling near like posies, without seeing your 30th? It's first place or no place, Dex. Cost isn't a factor. <laughs> Classic. I'd All expect right. nothing less from eager, wait, wait, supple wait. youth. Understood. Respect. Sure. All right. Listen close. Scanning a serious job now. 
plain gargantuan compared to smashing up a scav home. Let me hear it. What's the job? There's this prototype tech. A biochip to be precise. The job's to grab it. Simple. Yeah. <laughs> Guessing it belongs to a corp. Mm-hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. <laughs> Corps don't deserve special treatment. Shit. <laughs> you ain't playing around. Got a feeling this could be a start of a beautiful friendship built on heaps of eddies. You work this out? Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Needs active resolve in that. Second, a rendezvous. Simple. Klein who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. Klein. What's her thing? Why she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Betting her wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. End of convo. <laughs> anyway, our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, who'll be there for it all. Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Pretty much leaves you. What's the issue needs resolving with Maelstrom? Got a beef? Slot in the shard. Got a classic tale for you. Psycho gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a Militech convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see, convoy was carrying the flathead. A little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high grade military tech. Cause if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single-use toy. Now, I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say when, cause Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gangmate one Simon Randall, AKA Royce, plain dropped his ass. Royce is in charge now, and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's word. To add to this shitstrom, one Meredith Stout of Militech has developed an interest in said convoy. Who's the prima donna? Corpo agent, internal affairs. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip tied in her trunk. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter, so she must be getting <laughs> desperate. Be wise to think how you Love can the dialogue. Her. <laughs> of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. I think I got everything. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you. I'm not going to skip the ride. I want to experience everything. One more thing, Mr. B. Quiet life or blaze of glory? Hmm?
Okay, performing certain actions will reward you with street cred. You'll do street cred to make a name for yourself in the Night City Underworld. Doing so will open up new opportunities. Okay, got it. Now where am I going? Jackster, talk to Dex. <laughs> Gordito's a big deal. Literally a nod, yeah. You're weirding me out, V. Clint to want to check our pro cred. But to me, it feels more like he tangled us up with Maelstrom and Militech. There's this combat bot, military prototype. Maelstrom clepped it. Then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the gang goons had a switch up in management. I right, heard about that. Royce versus Brick. Hostile takeover. That sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deets of some Militech agent, too, but... I don't know how much help she stands to be. Ha. <laughs> on. Then there's the other thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table. Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow? Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. He must know what he's doing. So, how you wanna play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? I think we're gonna start with the client. Parker. I think I ought to see her first. See what she's like, what she's after. What I live. In that case, I'll hit the all foods and put my nose to the ground. Sniff around. Hasta luego. Okay. I don't like driving, so I'm gonna run everywhere. Plus, it'll give me a chance to check out the, the city. Check out the city. Wow, well, a lot of people walking around. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Rats are human sized. Look just like tiger claws, too. Biggest one is a certain Taki Kenmochi. So do your fixer a solid and neutralize her ass, will ya? Deeds attached. Thank you. 
Hello. Hey, what's up? How you doing? How are you? I'm doing great. How about yourself? Yeah, I'm racking up all these side jobs, but I'm gonna stick with the main quest first. Doing good seeing that you were streaming today from the MVG stream team and came to watch you play. Oh, well, thanks, man. Thanks. Are you an MVG? Yes. Oh, cool. Great group, man. I've been with them for about two or three years. Great group of people. Oh man! Just joined last month. All oh, right, on. Just need to look both ways. That hurt. We're closed right now. How is the game so far? Uh. I'm liking it. It's, uh, man, there's a lot to learn. It's, uh, what I'd hope for. <laughs> so, uh, I mean, I'm, I'm not, not complaining. When you're in danger, trauma you will be there. Okay, you're closed. Why can't I go in? It's supposed to be I am so. waiting for the game to download. Oh, are you downloading it right now? Yes. Oh, right on. 6 a.m. What time is it now? You have to wait till they open. Yeah, I'm seeing that. Okay. I think it was 6 p.m. Yeah, 6 p.m. to 6 a.m. <clears throat> Not sure how fast time uh, goes in here. And I can't skip time, so... LOL. <laughs> See, look. Cannot skip time right now. Well, so did the database. Vehicles. Weapons. Okay, well, I don't care about that. What branch were you in? Marine Corps. I'm a Vietnam veteran. Semper Fi. Thank you. You also a Marine? <sighs> All right, what do I do? What do I do? Wander around, I guess. I am 8,404 FMF Corpsman. Oh, love my corp corpsman, man. Gotta tell ya. You guys were the shit, Vietnam. Yeah, we took good care of our corpsman. You saved my life a few shums. I did, the core did. 
<laughs> I get what you're saying though, man, I really do. What? You want a new friend? <laughs> Did you hear that? I went to talk to this wow. person walking around. Let's see what happens when I do it with this guy. See? Hello? All right, well, I'm just doing this wandering around. The end is near. I knew there had to be one of them somewhere. Tell me about the end, man. Mind your damn business, yeah? <laughs> oh, well, you're saying the end is near. I wanted info. Jeez. Uh, it's only 4.24 p.m. I'm gonna skip time now. Is this a eighteen plus chat? Yeah. For something now, let's go. All right. Yeah, I couldn't skip time while I was standing in front of him. Yeah, it's 18 plus. But because of uh, of Twitch's new DCMA. Okay, I just did not want to say some bad words and get in trouble. Uh, you won't. Uh, yeah. I, with the DCM going on, I can't even play the music that was designed for the game. It's an option to turn off copyrighted music. That way my stream won't get muted. And then uh, I turned down nudity because you can't show nipples. So I turned that off. So I'm not able to play it as... I know so, dumb B. Yeah, Are you fucking serious? certainly dumb, but whatever. Oh, let's talk to this guy. He looks like a junkie. Okay. What do you want? What are you using that is reading to you? Oh, it's a, uh, it's called, uh, speech chat. What it does is it, uh, takes everything people type in chat and Look, makes it audio. Uh, I'm waiting for a That friend. way, when oh, someone, yeah. if I'm involved in I something in the game and I'm not really paying attention to chat, I can still, uh, respond. So. Cool. Looking a little put out there, input. <laughs> Interest you in a preem BD? What do you got? What don't we got? Women and men of your dreams. Synaptic acting A-listers, no washed up virtue porn boy toys or blow up dolls here. Oh, tur stuff. It'll grip your heart and blow your nerves right out of your body. Pure bit-based ecstasy. That's why people come here. I love the dialogue. You really know how to sell it. Not a sales pitch. It's a warning. I'll give you one word. Bespoke. Not for everyone's That sight. sounds fun. Think you can handle it? Another time. LOL. You know what? Maybe another time. Sure thing, stud. Reconsidered, huh? Bespoke? Damn, that sounds promising. I get it, I'm in. Mm-hmm. Couple of things you need to know first. <clears throat> Severe penalties for any unauthorized recording. No drugs, no groping. Someone catch your eye? You do not grab them. You find them in the catalog, 
Ask for a BD and get yourself a box. I really look that green to you. Like I don't know. Mm-hmm. Doors open. Have fun, input. Welcome to Lizzie's. Oh, that is cool. Look at that. That is really cool. My, what a sweet little face you have. Okay, how do I get in there? Not that way. Well, what? They have done such a good job with the physics. Oh, yeah. I'm really impressed. I had one thing happen. Uh, they did the combat tutorial last night. And you have this thing called the scanner. I'll How turn it on you? for you. See that? But it wouldn't go away. I could unscan. So I'm crawling around in this area because I'm going like half stepping through everything it was crazy my buddy got stuck in it too yeah it took me a minute to fix it but what i ended up doing is i ended up saving the game and then exiting and then coming back in uh, i exited the main menu and came back in and it was fine so it wasn't something that you got saved right. Hey. Get you something. I'm looking for Evelyn. I'm looking for Evelyn Parker. You know if she's here? Who's asking? Name's V, man. Name's V. She and I have a uh, date. Well, V, it's a pleasure. I'm Mateo. Uh huh. So. Evelyn? Club's big. We're gonna have to look around. Can't do it for you. It's all right, Mateo. I was waiting for this one. Evelyn Parker. I knew it was you as soon as you walked in. Sense on? Only tequila I drink. <laughs> How do you know? I like to know everything about the people I work with. Either that or it was just a lucky guess. Why are we meeting here? Any particular reason? Actually, it doesn't seem much like your thing, this place. Mm hmm. Hmm. <laughs> I'll take that as a compliment. Come on. No place we can talk where ears won't prick up to listen. We'll be in the lounge, Mateo. Anyone asks, we're not here. So, nothing's what wrong. Can really? Why don't you? Dex had a load to say about you. Called you professional, effective, and trustworthy. I hope he wasn't overselling. I'm waiting. All right. No idea if Dex exaggerates. A little, a lot. You got me. Just started working with him, in fact. I've heard there are two kinds of fixers. Those with stable crews on long contracts and short leashes. Loyalty and predictability they value above all else. Then there's the other kind. Dex's kind.
Come on. Can't leave that hanging. Headhunters. They lay their trust elsewhere. Not in people, but in a thing. Their intuition. They bet on potential. And if they lose that bet, it's the last mistake they ever make. I'm hoping <laughs> Dex's intuition has served him well in this case. <laughs> That's pretty funny. <laughs> BRB. Let's cut to the chase. What do you got for me? Your target. I trust you know what it is. Relic. Secure your soul trinket. Key tech in the program, actually. We're tangling with Arasaka, making this heist one dangerous, risky motherfucker. Mm-hmm. Arasaka's poured billions into personality transfer technology. But me, I just want the data on this one. The chip is tucked away inside Compeki Plaza, the hotel. You ever been? Classy Corp Hotels? Yeah, no. Out of my price range. Hmm. Oh, the decor's to die for. As you'll see for yourself. So where's this chip hiding, exactly? In a suite on the top floor. The room's occupied by Yorinobu Arasaka. Yorinobu Arasaka? He's in town? Don't you read the scream sheets? The media couldn't get enough of Yori coming to Night City. It was all over the headlines. Anyway, he's heir apparent to the Arasaka Empire. Saburo Arasaka's only surviving son. What? So Arasaka Jr.'s planning to grab the reins while in Night City? Only a handful of people in Night City know what the Arasaka's real plans are. Telling me you're one of them? Top dog like Yorinobu's bound to have an army on call. Hotel's probably a goddamn fortress by now, too. Yorinobu keeps exactly no hustle around. Not one guard. Got rid of them a long time ago. Huh. Why is that? Surely you know what they say about Arasaka Into. Sneeze in Night City, and a blossom drops from a cherry tree in Tokyo. <laughs> Yorinobu That's was convinced great. his Arasaka security detail reported directly to his father. I like to go through all the dialogue. So we're not jumping the corp. We're jumping Yorinobu Arasaka himself. <sighs> Yorinobu is a puppet. He lost all his cards years ago when he failed to do daddy's bidding. Saburo's had Yori's balls in a vice for years. He might just... Turn the screw and crush them outright if he learns his son's up to no good again. All right. Look, if you've got any spare aces up your sleeve, now's the time to show them. Now, this should make your prick perk up. Yorinobu recently swiped the chip from an Arasaka laboratory. He's made a deal with Netwatch. Aims to sell it to them. Have you spotted my ace yet, or do I need to spell things out? Wait, neutral Netwatch is mixed up in this. Netwatch provides Where did net you get the text to speech thing? And collects eddies in the millions. You know, I can't remember. But, but in this day and age, everyone just do a search for speech chat saint. in Google, and it should take you right to it. So what's your Nobu do to walk away with? Unimportant. You focus on the biochip. What could cyberspace's watchers and protectors offer him? Intelligence on his enemies? That doesn't matter in the least. Because you'll make sure the transaction never happens and I get the chip. Okay. Fine. So no Arasaka security on the device because your Nobu whisked it away in secret. Now, where's he hiding it? Well, likely in a specialized container. One that mimics an organic neural environment. On the outside, it looks like an ordinary briefcase. And the case is? You'll see for yourself soon enough. Provided we're done gossiping about the Arasakas.
I'm waiting. Okay, what's next? Now comes the best part. Follow me. Got something for you. Should help you plan. Brain dance from Compeki Plaza. How's a brain dance supposed to help? Need facts, not thrills. <laughs> Think BDs are only good for fondling virtual tits? Jacking off to in those boxes? <laughs> no. It can be a very useful tool. Oh my good god. For analyzing details, human perception, even boosted, doesn't grasp. Exactly what you need. So what's on the tape? Yorinobu's suite. The glorious interior. You'll need to locate the relic yourself. Hope I grabbed enough detail to make that possible. Would you Look, like anything else? Time. No, 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 I don't want to hear it. It's it. No, no. Hold up. Mean to say you recorded this? Mm hmm. BD rec implant. Why? You object? Supposed to be Yorinobu's pad on the tape. Means you were inside. You know each other? How else could I get all this intel? I know him pretty well, actually. We have an arrangement. Strictly business. Suits us both, I think. Let's see this brain dance. Judy will help. She's a mox, too. Besides, we go back, uh, mm -hmm. years. V, this is important. Judy's always been there for me. Always helped out. I trust her. But she's a mox, not the latest member of your crew. Try not to forget. How much? So, you'll no, be a good no, boy. Tread lightly. The break. And keep that tongue on a leash. Oh, oh I am Relax. You? Believe it or not, I'm no stranger to tact. In biz or life. This is V. He's here for that BD role. And V, this is Judy. Best brain dance editor I know. Enough already. You're gonna make me barf. Hey, Judy. Compiled your BDF. What do you think? Will it do? Still pretty raw. But yeah, ought to do. Mm-hmm. V needs to get deep inside. That's most important. So, let's calibrate. Tune it to him. Believe me, I've dealt with worse. You should see the jig-jig street porn we gotta contend with sometimes. So, we drop V inside. Let him look, let him rummage around, right? How about it, V? Raw brain dance. Ever taken a dip before? V, focus. Wait a second, I gotta check something. Are you hearing my voice okay? I, I wanna do a mic check. Hello? What do you mean by raw? How's this differ from the ready mates? Huh. Ready-mades, provided they're well-made, should feed you feelings and impressions you'd never have the chance to experience yourself in real space. But it's mass-market shit, so it's pre-crafted, hard-coded, fenced-in, and you just fine. Fenced in Great, and thanks. Vegetable. A raw one? Well, it's more like a virtue in Viro. Get to move around, look at things in detail. Editors use those layers to fish for juicier emotes and impulses, then use them to pad the BDs that go to market. Sit down, settle in, and we'll get you going. Sit where? Oh, there. Okay, got it. A 
I like how it shows uh, that yeah, chair no problem. Yeah, I like how they show that chair is being worn out. Leather's cracked on it and everything. That's pretty cool. I like the attention to detail. Got to create your sensory profile first. What's that? Dutch mutant what hello. Profile now. A model of your perceptions and emotional responses. Need to adjust that so the raw BD won't overwhelm you. If I don't, hello. best case scenario, you'll get nauseous as soon as you're. Hey, how you doing, Dutch? Barf like you would in a shoddy virtue enviro. Mm-hmm. And worst case. Your synapses sizzle like locusts in a deep fryer. <laughs> but we're not about to let that happen. <laughs> <laughs> okay, profile away. Booyah. Okay. Hit me. Just promise me it won't hurt. It won't. Not this time. Now sit still. Look at me. Gonna run the analysis soft. Should feel a slight tingling. <laughs> mm-hmm. I am okay. Yeah, well, okay, thanks for being here. I appreciate you watching my stream. Hope states. you enjoy it. Look smack into these two screens. Pretend it's an eye exam. One more sec. Need to get the pain receptor limiters in. How do you like the okay. game so far? I like Set. it. I need to test Been waiting for two years for it. Tossing in a sample BD. You can use it to get to know the editor. Now let me see, where could we... Can't he just use my recording? Why are we wasting time? So we don't risk our necks? Sides won't take a sec. Got something here. Should be perfect. Boot it up. Mm-hmm. Let me give you the tailored version first. Let you get your bearings. Then we'll jump into editing mode. Be diving in in three... Two, one. Whoa, that's bright. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. And remember, everything on full blast. They'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline high. Okay, on you go. Going to play it tomorrow, just downloading it. Oh, Roger that. Down, everybody, on the ground. I want to see you kissing the flooring. Money, now, or I will fucking drop you, I swear to God. Whoa, yeah, uh, hey, uh, now, before I blow your fucking head off. Slow, deep breaths. Your cortisol and adrenaline spiked, but the soft activated your hormone blockers. Nothing happened. You're alive and well. All right. That was too much. Felt, I could feel the guy's pain, his stress, his hope. Hope wrapped up in something else. Mm-hmm. Probably took a booster just before. You'll be fine. Got everything set up? Let's switch over to editing mode. I'll sever the link to the BD Roller's sensory array. You'll be able to look around free. All seems yours. Full cam control in analysis mode, so move around, zoom in and out, whatever else you come up with. Think of it as your own little sandbox. So, analysis mode, you control playback. Can even pause when you feel the need. Then you use the editor console to unpause. Try it. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. Dream as hell, right? Well, that's not all. You can speed things up or rewind, whatever you like. Give it a try. Rewind. Roll it back got to the top. All good. Neat. Now try fast-forwarding a bit. Plan simple. 
do nothing odd. No. Read it. You go in, snatch the cash, yeah, and send the email like a Okay. You can also reset the recording. That'll take you right back to the beginning. Try it. Now for some fun. This here's why you came in the first place. In analysis mode, you get to view and even scan details of the enviro recorded by the BD roller. Focus on the heat, the gun this gonk gets from his buddy at the beginning. Now scan it. I don't see a gun. They're going to you spot the gun. Oh, okay, got it. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out, and we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. And remember, everything on full blast. They'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline high. Okay, on you go. Okay, right here. Scan and inspect the gun, okay. Excellent. Let's move on. Now heads up. In analysis mode, you can ferret out background noise and conversations if the roller got close enough. This tech records everything, every little detail, even the sights and sounds the roller was never aware of. To see the sources of the recorded sensory signals, switch to the audio layer in the editor. Go ahead and try that now. Okay, good. Now you should see several sound signatures in the store. Choose one and hone in on it. Can't see a thing. That's like the limits of the reality recorded by the BD roller. The editor won't let you outside it. Make sense? Yeah. Six case of brosif and a couple of zappers. Okay, we have a deal today on two flavors, cutty and yeah. serpent. Everybody. So, any thoughts? Unbelievable. Seriously, like what's happening right next to me. Yeah, it's how BD recording implants work. They pick up everything, all the elements in the background. Then an editor tweaks them, makes them pop. Keep playing with the sound, explore it a bit. We'll move on when you get bored. Sometimes you can analyze extra layers in the raw, stuff the roller's cyberware picked up. Like what? Ev's got Kiroshi optics that grab infrared, meaning you should be able to grab heat signatures from her recording. Huh, <laughs> hello nice. Now let's wait till the guy punches out the gonk at the counter. On the ground! You wanna see you kissing the flooring? Muddy! Scanning works on peeps, too. Walk up to the wounded chick. Try scanning her. A 
All right, next thing. Scroll forward to the part where our artist gets a lead injection. Now! My favorite part of the game. See the blinking thing over the entrance? Surveillance cam. Must have caught our shooter. You'll see in a sec. Cam feeds to the screen behind the clerk. Roll back to where the screen's in the kid's field of vision, then scan it. Oh, okay. Rewind till the CT CCTV screen appears. His own chumba shot him. Probably planned to all along. Must have got a nice slice of cred on the black market for a BD like this. BD freaks are ready to pay a preem for a real flatline. Anyway, if you've seen enough, you can exit. Wow. That was something. Yeah, it's impressive, right? It's too bad most of the BDs we do here are only good for flogging the log. Anyway, <laughs> you ready to do this? Look at your wreck. No way. Let's take a break. Still feel like that kid when... Oh, yeah. Think I'm done. V, there's no time. Get it together, please. Okay. Okay. Go ahead. Just need T-Bug to link in. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Who? Running for my crew. Security specialist. She'll tell me what to look for while we analyze. No problem, I hope. Actually, it is a problem. Not what we agreed, Ev. Judy, T-Bug's a professional, discreet to a fault. You can trust her. Why? Because you say so? Please, Judy. I'd never expose you to any danger. You know that. Okay, V. Call T-Bug and we'll dive in. Hey, V, what's happening? Bug, listen. I got some useful footage from Compecky Plaza. It's a brain dance. Compecky? Oh, thought as much. Someone there with you? Judy and Evelyn, they're chill. They're helping me work through this BD. Uh-huh. All right. You gonna tell me what this is about? Listen, need your help. Got no clue what to look for once I'm in. All right, see if I can walk you through it. Jacking into your tech now. Mm, you've got to give me access. Opening port 1779. Secure protocol? Good, I'm going in. Should be getting my request now. Got it. You ready? A millisecond. Okay, connection confirmed. Now some quick tip ice and we're clear. Ready to dance. Fire up, Judy. Alright, 
V. Eyes open. Gotta find out where you're know who's keeping the relic. You look like a cut of fuckable meat, are you? Evelyn, she... I felt her fear. Sure got it under control quick, too. I said no! They'll have my head for this. Then, you shall perish for a good cause. But uh, make yourself comfortable. I need a minute to... Listen in on that conversation, V. Could be something important. Finish. We shall see soon enough. My father's attired, visionless old gray beard, who thinks nothing will change, and he'll live forever in his tiny frozen bubble. Wow, champagne's Are decent. They removed from reality. Taste boosted somehow. Stuck in no, some fossilized vision of a world Same bubbly, you'll that no longer real exists. Of a world that may never have existed. We have not seen eye to eye for the past 20 years. I am quite sure we want now. Not it. It... Go back to when they first start talking. Need to hear the whole thing. Fossilized vision of a world that no longer exists. Of a world that may never have existed. We have not seen eye to eye for the past 20 years. I am quite sure we want now. Noted. Enough. Oh, okay. So I know what I have to do. Business. Can't be stupid. Hmm. It wasn't long. Not even long enough for me to grow bored. Is everything all right? You seem tense. Snatch me. Listen to this. Saburo is an adult despot, utterly removed from reality. Stuck in some fossilized vision of a world that no longer exists. Of a world that may never have existed. We have not seen eye to eye for the past 20 years. I am quite sure we want now. Noted. Enough. Sorry to make you wait. Business can't be stupid. Mm, it wasn't long. Not even long enough for me to grow bored. Is everything all right? You seem tense, edgy. A moment, it will pass. <sighs> I can get to work on that. Just one condition. You wish to make demands of me. Only one. Focus. Pretty fun last time. Bedroom. Nice set. I've got an idea. Be right back. Very nice. 
but come here already. Just a sec. Looking for the perfect thing. Ah, uh, you'll like this. What love is Until you've learned the meaning of the world. <laughs> We shall see soon enough. I need to see social. Good cause. But uh, make yourself comfortable. I need a minute to finish. We shall see soon enough. My father's a tired, visionless old gray beard who thinks nothing will change and he'll live forever in his tiny. I need a minute to finish. The program is still in the trial phase. We cannot take it to market as is. We shall see soon enough. Please speak with your father. He's taken a particular interest in this project. He can certainly explain the reason. My father's a tired, visionless old gray beard who thinks nothing will change and he'll live forever in his tiny frozen bubble. I should not even be listening to such things. You will listen to this. Saburo is an adult despot, utterly removed from reality. Stuck in some fossilized vision of a world that no longer exists. Of a world that may never have existed. We have not seen eye to eye for the past 20 years. I am quite sure we want now. Read the documentation carefully. The relic requires specific storage conditions. You must no provide relic. them. In Heard that? Relic dots gotta be around here somewhere. Look for them. All right, where's the hell's the data pad? Oh. Sorry to make you wait. Business. Can't be stupid. Hmm, it wasn't long. Not even long enough for me to grow bored. Is everything all right? You seem tense. Edgy. A moment. It will pass. Hmm. I can get to work on that. Just one condition. You wish to make demands of me? Only one. Focus on me. Oh, got any candy left? Stuff was pretty fun last time. Bedroom. Nightstand. I've got an idea. Oh, okay, I know what I need to do. Versus data pad uh all right I don't get it I miss this you oh jeez
Ah, jeez. All right, I'm not getting it. In her purse? Where did she put it? Come on, give me a clue here. That's right there. But where's the data pad? Where's the frickin' data pad at? Yeah. 
Okay. Where the hell is this data pad? Don't see the data pad. What the fuck? Hold on a minute. Manual details a special tip controlled container. Relic needs to be kept real cool. So, chip's got to stay in the freezer. Yep, could damage it otherwise. Okay, switch on thermal layer detection in the editor. Should be easier to spot where your Nobu's keeping the chip.
Oh, Donna Geese. Looks like Mr. Arasaka had something to celebrate. Really think you'll find the chip in there? No way. Tim's too low. Could fluctuate. Nice try, though. Yeah, I got my grandson helping me out. Hello, invisible man here. Oh, got any candy left? So this bar of candy. I'm out of range. How do I take it? So right now, Bravo, you're in a virtual program. Right. She's over near the guy. So let's get yeah. Okay. So now, now they're doing something. <laughs> That's the end of the recording. <sighs> now shut up! Where he starts talking on the phone? Yes, and then you want to follow. That's the only way. It's a lot of back and forth, Jack. Now, do what now? Oh, so you're not, not 
Oopsie. Fast forward still. Fridge. Tip doesn't match the guidelines. We'll find a thing here. Nothing's changed. Let's continue. Let's continue back. Keep backtracking. Yep. Let me see something pop up here. Right. Grab the heat sig. Matches the spec of the docks. Yorinobu's got the case here. Guaranteed. Mm-hmm. We got it. Good work. Looks like we got everything we need. Quit out of the editor. So let's not do that. Grandpa, no? Okay, now let's go all the way back. Can I just wonder, are those cameras up there? Nope. So, okay. You want me to show you where everything is? So no, I, 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 I can find it. So, right. so I want to fast forward now? Nope. So that's going to be your site. That's going to be your site. That is going to be your site. So anything here will point to any clues that are in the kitchen. So I go out of thermal and back into visual? Yep. So now. I'll see squat. with new tech. Motion sensors, heat sig activators, IFF. You skilled enough to kill it all? Mucho more than enough. Just need access to their subnet. Oh, you see what you've seen? Why isn't it scanning? Scan. Exit brain dance when you're ready. So ready. Go down. There's still more on this area. Let's be on the other side of the wall. Still back up? Alarm firmware is fresh, but saw excited birds chirping on a BBS. Something about lots of seeds falling through. I got the both suit. of those. Let me generate keys. I can forge their six. Now what I'm doing? Now you still have two security. This is really complicated. Yep. Yeah, my grandson's helped me with this, so uh, bear with me, guys. Yep. Oh, yeah, one view. They'll have my head for this. Talk anyway. Talk anyway. Oh, I do. All right. So Keep. there's nothing so So we're at this point. She'll perish for a good cause. Yeah. 
Automated turrets. Latest scanner model. System is all connected to the server. Can you shut them off? Externally, no way. Gotta get in, check out how they link into the system first. Mm-hmm. Looks like all their security systems are linked to the hotel subnet. We need the flathead. No other way to shut down these systems. I'm sorry about it, Can't get around them ourselves? <laughs> nope. At least I'm fresh out of ideas. All right. Get everything you need? What? Yep. That'll do. Thanks, Judy. We got it. Later, T-Bug. Nice work today. See you soon. I'll wipe the cash on your data. You were never here. Keep it. I'll put it on Ev's tab. Portable device for handling BDs. I already uploaded your calibration settings. Not as sophisticated as what we got here, but should do the trick. And it keeps you out of harm's way. Clever. Speaking of harm's way, know what I see looking at you? Walking, talking corpses. <laughs> Judy, relax. Nobody will ever know. Evelyn, please. No shortcuts. You go that route, city will always win. So be careful. Of course I will be. Besides, we'll talk in a bit. V, one sec. Let's walk. We're walking, we're walking, we're walking. Well, what do you think? Intel on Yorinobu, the chip, the BD from Compeki. Winds are right, plan's perfect. Job like this comes one in a million. Hmm, thanks. Now the punchline, please. Just sounds too good to be true. What's the catch? Cold feet. Are you looking to get out of it? I want to know if you're really in control here. You're not sending me into the sort of shit I can't wait out of. V, I have zero reasons to haze you. We're in this together, really. Trust me that I got this. You're not worried? Our sock will flag and screen anyone who's had dealings with Yorinobu. Oh, they'll have a long list then. Packed full of big names. Much bigger than mine. You tell me who they check first. Corpo hotshots and cutthroats? Or a little bedroom plaything like me? I think I see how you know so much about Yorinobu. It's simple. Men like pillow talk a bit too much. So it's just about the sex. Biz. And biz only. You sure Yorinobu doesn't expect this kind of move from you? He's got no idea. Trust me. He's too busy with Netwatch to give me that kind of attention. Besides, even if some suspicion takes root in his mind, it shouldn't matter. He won't react in time. And that's something you'll handle, right? Yep. So what now? So, what now? V, <coughs> do this job for me. I mean me alone. No splitting the payout with anyone else. No middlemen. No decks. Well, what do you think? No fucking way. Dex took a leap with me. He trusts me. Now I'm doing the same. 50%. With cred like that in your account, you won't need Dex for anything. Yep, not gonna do it. No, Evelyn. 
It's not just about the money. I thought you were a merc. I thought it was always about the money. Not behind the back of someone who trusts me. Sorry. Fine. I never asked. But V? Hmm? I just hope you're as good as you are naive. If you need me, call. I'll send you my number. Okay. Good luck. Now go. I need a few words with Judy. Now go. I need a few words with Judy. How things looking, Mr. V? Turns out Evelyn's recording from Compeki was worth our time. Beautiful. T-Bug already called. Said she's working her magic. And a flathead? Nothing yet. On it now. T-Bug says no chance of that ship without that buy. To work then, Mr. V. Okay, well I'm gonna save it right here. I've got to make lunch for my family, so I will be back later on. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you're having a great day where you are. And uh, I will be back in a few hours. Talk to you later.